everyone and welcome or welcome back to the channel today we're doing an island tour and i'm very excited because today we are touring a kid core island we are i'm very excited because i absolutely adore kid core thank you first to kiara for letting us tour your island honeywind today here's what kiara has to say about her island so this is a mainly yellow and blue island with kid core theme that leans into spring core all of the villages color coded and fit perfectly into the scenery took inspiration from Fleur's pink and white kid core island but put my own spin on it. Now this is my first ever kid core-ish island and I'm kind of falling in love with this style. I know 100% I'm gonna love this because I love kid core islands. I love them. So I'm very very excited. Look at this cute flag first of all. How stinking cute. By the way if you would like to see your island toured on my channel please do fill in the google form linked below. Now I've yapped on enough. Let's see the map. So here is the map for Honeywind. There is the dream dress along the bottom if you'd also like to tour along with me but oh look at this map it is covered a lot of it is covered by in-game path i see oh i like the museum area up there can't wait to see that but who have we got we have pippi francine julian broccolo marshall azalea groucho daisy blue bear and filbert okay my favorite villager i have to go for azalea she's like top 10 for me she's like top 10 of my villagers so i'm gonna choose her let me know your favorites down below right we got a lovely blue airport to match the theme also we were kindly left some clothes so that we fit in so i got these cute little blue i think they're called dreamy clothes but they're so cute thank you so much i did have shoes on but i took them off because they didn't go with my outfit so <laughs> we're going around barefoot today but look at this beautiful entrance oh my gosh gyroids oh i love the gyroids Oh, this is already so, so cute. Oh my goodness. I love these little codes on the floor. And lovely use of the in-game dirt path. And I really like this code that you've used to line the dirt path. It's very, very cute. I think we're going to go in here first. I want to have a look what this is because this is so cute. It's like a little park. We've got the little flowers and the little duckies. Oh my gosh, this is too precious. By the way, I quickly, I forgot to say something. I have had a lot of people fill in tour forms. So, so sorry if I don't get to tour everyone's island, but I am doing my best. Right, let's go up this way though. So, resident services is just up here past these walls. As you can see, my beautiful, beautiful, stunning bed that is not so stunning. Oh, look at this code. Okay, some of these are crystal cats. I recognize them. I recognize some of the codes. All right, let's go to the... Is this a teddy bear cafe? Stop. Stop. I want to go here every single day. Oh my gosh, the little snacks and the drop cupcakes. Oh, this is so cute. I love the fencing. Oh my gosh, I love it all. I love Kid Core. I really do. And everyone knows at the moment I've been itching to do more of the theme, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to do one final Kid Core island, I think. I say one. <laughs> I want to do one final kid call before the new game comes out, but this is so adorable. I love the theme of blue and yellow. I feel like you don't normally see those colors together, so it's very refreshing to see. I see an ice cream truck. I want to go down these, these stairs. Oh my gosh, look. Oh, it's so cute. The ice cream truck. Oh my god. Wait, what is that? Oh, you've used the record box as a window. That is genius. Absolute genius. Oh, look at this paintbrush code. My mind is blown. Oh no, are these gnomes playing with the ball? They're playing beach ball. Oh, I love that. I love it when anyone puts the gyroids or the gnomes together to make it look like they're doing something. It's just, it's too cute. All right, we're going to go along the beach first. Oh my gosh, the gnomes everywhere. This is gnome beach. This is 100% gnome beach. By the way, I always forget that all this exists. So you know this beach furniture, like the chairs and the sun lounges and stuff. I forget they exist every single time. I'm terrible. That's probably why I never do the beaches because I'm like, what am I supposed to decorate with? Forgetting that those items exist. I think what we have to do though is head back this way. I did see an incline over here, but I also saw some beach. Oh, I can't get to the beach from this part. So that's fine. Let's go up here though of this incline. Oh, I love how it's surrounded by the walls, the medieval walls. I don't know why. I just really like how that feels oh my gosh oh the stroller i always forget that this exists too the number item that i just forget about oh this is cute a little table to enjoy some tea and some muffins and some cookies and also there's a house here oh whose house is this 
Oh, this is Daisy's house. So I have been told that none of the interiors are decorated, but all the exteriors are. So Daisy has a cute customized house. She also, I'm guessing, is in charge of the laundrette. Is she, she in charge of this? This is cute. Oh my gosh. This beautiful laundrette. Oh dear. Wow. I am blown away right now. Oh, everything works so well. Also, I love that you not just use yellow and blue. I think I made that mistake on Hoppington. I just used yellow and green and it really did tire me out from those colors. Although I love yellow. I didn't get tired of yellow. It was just the green. I should have broke it up with more white, but I didn't want to go back through and add loads of white furniture everywhere just to break it up. So you did great though. You did amazing with this. Oh, look, the ice furniture. Why does the ice furniture work so well with kid core? I feel like some of us need to use it more. Look at it. I mainly use it on my Halloween islands, but I think I might start using it when I do a kid core island again. Right, who lives here? This is Julian's house. Julian's got a cute little tea area outside. Also, I wonder who his neighbor is. We'll go check in a second. Oh, the snail. Oh my gosh, the little snail code. Also, these ornaments, they kind of look like, like little balls, you know? They look like tiny little balls cute seating area what a great filler idea look who lives in this house azalea sweet azalea lives here oh she's so precious she's like i said she's one of my top 10 oh there's a ladder well i must go down i must not be rude and not go down oh, okay we go down again oh wait could i have gone along there i want to quickly see can i go along here oh yes look it's loads of stalls it's like a market and then i think it continues down here as well wow look at that i actually really like the color blue at the moment i don't know what it is blue never used to be one of my favorite colors but you know what it is now i think it's because i've gone off green but this is so cute i love that you've used the block stools the block stools definitely give me huge kiko vibes so perfect to use those oh we can get on the beach oh my gosh this little jam stand I love, I love, I love the jam stand. I don't know what it was, but that jam stand caught me off guard and I'm obsessed. Right, we seem to have found the campsite. Let's go along this way first. Look, more of these. Why do I forget about these and these? I just forget about them. I'm terrible. I must not forget. I have to remind myself. Oh, it's so cute. I love your beaches. I'm getting some inspiration, you know? Sometimes I feel like I put too much pressure on myself to make it look, you know, overly ridiculously full. And this is the perfect type of fall that I need to do. Oh, wait, are these cushions on top of a biscuit code? Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. You can put code under there? Did I know this? Did I know this or did I not know this? I don't know if I did or not, but whatever, I, I like it. <laughs> I like this little card you have underneath your campsite and the campsite is very stinking cute let's wiggle on back i love that you've got plushies sitting all at the tables it's too perfect honestly way too perfect okay i think oh can we are we meant to go across that no i don't think so so i'm gonna go back up these ladders oh yeah because there's a bridge i can see a bridge so yeah we're meant to go back up these ladders oh we've come to another house okay this villager is in i don't want to go inside so i'm going to check on the map who it is okay so this is blue bear's house blue bear's got oh is this a toy shop oh my goodness what and how and wow and oh my gosh honestly what this this is amazing this is amazing i'm truly inspired but i shouldn't have visited this island if i'm honest because you know i'm craving kick all right now and this is just making it bigger <laughs> This is making my cravings bigger. There's a boba strawberry tea, but I'm going to leave it because I think it's part of the decoration. I could be wrong, though. Down that ladder, though, we got a cute little area to play plaza games. Oh, wow. Oh, I love this. Honestly, I'm, I'm blown away. I'm blown away. I want to get down there, though. I can see this stuff down there. Can I get down there? I cannot get down there. That is a challenge. <laughs> Unless I'm not supposed to. Unless it's blocked off, then... That's a very clever way to do that. I don't know what it is about this waterfall going off the edge there, but I'm obsessed. Right round this little pathway we go. And oh, look, this view. Is that Able Sisters? Wait, I want to go. Then we go down. I'm going down. So yeah, this is Able Sisters. Wow, look at all the clothes outside. We got all the clothes. There's cute little dresses and hats. And Able Sisters is just hidden behind these walls. I've always wanted to use this variation of the castle wall. And so it's really nice to see it. There's a little changing room outside. And also a little area for you to do some drawing. Oh, and some shoes. 
Everything about this is too cute. Right, let's go this way. Car beds, no way, you use the car beds. Here, here is my thought process. These, these are perfect for kid court. I know we have in-game cars now. We have the little car item. But what is it about these in kid court that just works so well? It's because they're beds, right? They're like little beds. And they just work so well. They work better than the other cars. Oh, actually, no, that's a lie. They both work the same, but these cars give off a different vibe. And I love the vibe they give. Right, let's go down here. Oh, no, I think I've gone... I think I might have gone the wrong way. I see this little gas station. I was too obsessed with the cars. I was, like, ignoring the gas pumps. Here's a little uh, storage area. Yeah, this is, like, little storage for the garage. Also, these... These fences, these panels, I can't remember what the real name is. It's um it's wooden fence something. I've always wanted to use this colour too. What is this view? Oh. oh wait, that's the museum. Look at that view. Wait, I want to get down there. Can we get down there? Yes. We can get down there. We're going over this way. I want to see what this is all about. Look at this picnic. Oh my gosh, teddy bear picnic. There is a teddy bear picnic. I can't get to it, but oh my gosh. And oh, oh, look at this. Wait, I need my camera out. Oh, wow. I have never, ever seen someone use the kid's tent as like a centerpiece for something. It's genius. It works so well for kid core. Are you kidding me? And there's also another teddy bear picnic this side. This is, this is too cute. I love this. Oh, no. I want to do kid core. Oh, no. The fire flower farm. I'm inspired. I'm inspired by everything I'm seeing right now. I love the flower, the flower fires, the fire flowers. I love that you use those. Oh no, is this a train? Okay, I have a weakness for trains. I have a weakness for any type of train on an Animal Crossing island. I don't know what it is. I just do. I really want to get down here. Oh, I can. I don't know if I'm supposed to, but I am. I want to go see this. Oh yeah, we can look. Oh, it's too cute. I love this. I absolutely adore this so much. Are you kidding me? I'm obsessed. I'm truly obsessed. Also, I did run down to here quickly because I was like, oh, I'm curious if, you know, it's decorated if I'm supposed to go down here. And I think I am because look. Oh, that's so cute. On the end here, a little picnic with the teddy bears. A little plushy picnic. Also, all these little pieces here, look. All these little outcrops decorated. Look at them decorated are you kidding me the attention to detail on this island is crazy good wow 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 what? right let's go back up we still have loads to explore which makes me so excited let's follow the train tracks though so this leads you to the actual museum itself oh wow the fact that you can go past on the little train oh my gosh if only we could have real train tracks and have a train that we could ride around our island that'd be so so cute i would absolutely love that imagine oh <gasps> Imagine if it's in a new game, you can build train tracks and your villagers can go on it and go on a ride around whatever you're building, island, whatever it is in the new game. That would be the best. Truly, honestly, the best. Okay, I don't want to go too far. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, we do have to go down here. Look at all these seating areas, by the way. Look at these. And there is wheat filled and it's not overused like I use it. <laughs> right, down here we go. Back down this way. I love the terraforming you've done, by the way. I love these little islands in the water that you've decorated. Oh, look at the little bear code. Oh, that's so cute. I don't want to go over to the right yet. I think I want to go down here because this lead back to resident services. And we've missed this whole bit out. Oh, we got a supermarket. Wait, this is Nook's. Wait, this is Nook's Cranny. I, I don't know what to do. I'm just going to run in circles. So this is next to Nook's Cranny. A little supermarket. There's Nook's Cranny. Oh, I love this island so much. Inspired. Also, I love the flower code you've used on the road. It's not too, too much, you know. It is enough. It's not too much. It's bright enough and I love it. Okay, candy sweets. We got a candy shop. What's more perfect than this on a Kiko Island, right? We love sweets. Oh, that's resident services. There's a lot of owls. I got to learn to not say owl everything. But honestly, I get so carried away. I love these islands. Wait, we went up there. Yeah, we did. I was like, don't want to miss anything. So we seem to be back at resident services. Now we've gone down there because that's where we went to the airport. We can go up here though. So I want to go up this way. Oh, look at the slide. Oh, this is a little park. This is an adorable little park and we have a view. 
Are you kidding me? Look at this view. It's absolutely stunning. Also, I love the colors. I do. It, like I said before, it's just so refreshing to see these colors together. I think we're going to head down this way. No way. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, I love it so much. I now want to go down this incline because we saw the houses. So we head to the left first. Does this lead back to... Oh, yes, this leads back to Nook's Cranny. So we're going the right way. We're not going to miss anything. I want to go back here because I can see all these houses. So this is the resident rep house. Oh, it's a little hospital. Oh, the little bear. Oh, wow. Do you know what? I've always wanted to use the hospital items and I've never been able to because I've never had anything that I can use them for. But using them like this is so, so clever. I, I really like this. Right, let's look at this house. Who's this house belong to? Francine. Okay, that's why there's a bunny rabbit outside. Oh, she has a cute... Oh, it's a joint yard. I was going to say she has a cute yard, but it's a joint cute yard. Who does she get to live with? Of course, Pippi. Pippi is also a rabbit, in case you don't know, because I feel like not a lot of people have Pippi, so I just wanted to, to make sure you all knew who Pippi was. Who gets to live in this cute little house? Groucho. Okay, Groucho. A bear, right? He's a bear. I'm pretty sure he's a bear. Right, that leads on to the beach. We'll go to the beach in a second. I want to go back here to see these houses. Wow, look at this little cafe. Oh my gosh. And then who gets to own the cafe? Oh, this is Marshall's house. Look at this beehive area. I love this. I absolutely love this. And then another villager lives here. This is Philbert's house. I guess Philbert is the one who looks after the bees, right? Because he's got the butterfly outside. I could be wrong. Now you can actually go right back here. So this is Red Secret Beach. And look at this storage area. Does this not scream Red Storage Area? It's kind of like a fishing dock. So is Red a fisher? Or is he a fisherman rather? He's a fisher. He fishes for fishes. Oh, that's just the fishing dock. Maybe Red doesn't take it because Red's a criminal. Let's go back this way. No, I like Red. I like Red. He's just a bit, you know, you can't trust him. I want to go to this house over there. They've got a little dog house. So I'm going to say that this is a dog that lives here. Oh, no, I checked the map. It's Brocolo. <laughs> Brocolo lives here. We got a cozy outdoor cinema area. I love all these blankets on the floor. Oh my gosh. I just want to grab this popcorn and shove it in my face. By the way, do you prefer sweet or salted popcorn? Let me know. Yeah, let me know your popcorn preferences down below. I love all this rockeration. And this is Zalia. Hi, Zalia. Precious. Okay, should we be going down the beach? I'm going to go down the beach anyway. Because look at all these little areas that are decorated. Look at it all. All this decoration? Oh my goodness. So we've got to the bottom of the beach. I don't think I was meant to go down here, so I'm going to run back up. So we're back by the houses. We can cut back down this way. I think we should go back up here. Oh, we actually, we haven't been up here. I'm like, hey, we should go back up here. We've not even been up here. Oh, wow. Look at this library. I love how this looks. You can just walk through. Oh, wait, this is a school. That's the school library. And here's the classroom. This is so, so cute. I love the attention to detail. I love these as well. These at the side. And then there's a, another board here. And there's a science experiment over here. Some toys. And then outside we have the lockers. And oh, this would be the canteen, right? This would be the cafeteria. And this is where you'd have your lunch. They're eating lunch of pumpkin plates. I want pumpkin plates. <laughs> I would definitely eat my lunch on pumpkin plates. I love Halloween, so I would love to do that. All right, we got a little park as well. This is a school playground, I'm guessing. All right, let's go back down because I feel like there's one more area we haven't seen. I'm going to see if I can get to it. I think I've got to go along here and then go down this way. Oh, wait, there's our resident rep. Hello. Hello. Hey, little bear. Oh, that's so cute. And by the way, your character looks so adorable. Oh. She's so precious. And then we got a lovely little hopscotch. Right, let's head down this way though. This is the bit we haven't got to. Oh, I love all these little walkways. They're so detailed and so well decorated. I'm obsessed with this. I want to do kickoff. I want to do a kickoff island. Across the bridge we go though. Is this the funfair area? This is a carnival, right? Carnival funfair area. Oh my gosh. 
it's so cute i love all the codes all the colors all the fun it does make you feel like you just want to run around everywhere look at this the um carousel i always get it wrong i always either call it carousel or a ferris wheel it's one of those i know it's a carousel i do i just get them mixed up but this is so cute wow i love this so much what an adorable island i do think that was the last place we had to see though but look at these ducks look at these ducks i love them but i think that was the last place i'm kind of sad i'm kind of sad we finished touring but there we have it everyone we have finished today's tour thank you so much to cara for letting me tour your island today and thank you for sharing it with everyone we had a lot of fun but you've now made me want to do a kid call island even more now anyway if you enjoyed today's island tour please be sure to hit that like button also leave a comment what was your favorite part about this island today and subscribe if you haven't already come join the jellybean family and i hope you have the loveliest of days and i will see you in my next one goodbye